all right guys hello welcome back to another video in this video we're gonna be discussing the best way to save money watch at the end of the video because i will be showing you one great strategy to save money and to cut back and know how to cut back this video is gonna be useful for you if you're trying to save money but i will show you a good way to cut back and know how to save money stay tuned to the end of the video and i will show you it's important for you to move your money around what I mean by this is when you get your money, when you get your paycheck, not leaving one place. That's not what I do. I send it to a, an account I have in Acorns. In that account, I always send $100 every week, every Friday, $100. That means a month is $400 in that card. So if I get paid $1,000, I'm going to keep $600 in my regular account. That's Wells Fargo. I have a Wells Fargo card and an Acorns card. So I get a direct deposit in my Wells Fargo card. That means like if I get paid a thousand a week, bi-weekly, I mean bi-weekly, a month. So let's say I get my first check and it goes to my bank account, my Wells Fargo account. When it gets there a Friday, automatically, it will send a hundred dollars from that card to my Acorns card. So I know I already have a hundred dollars to spend in stuff I need that my list I uh, created groceries I could spend uh, probably 50 bucks this week in grocery store in the grocery store and not next week okay now from 100 if I spend 50 I have another 50 okay I'm gonna spend 20 going out to eat okay so that's how you keep track of your money and the other one the other card if you get paid a thousand already and you send it you sent 100 and you see 900 next week you see 800 right because it's another Friday so another Friday means that it took out a hundred from that account and sent it to other account. So now you have a hundred and twenty-five if you didn't waste the rest, you didn't waste it, right? So I will make another video explaining the acorns. If you're interested in getting acorns, I will leave a link in the description so you could use to get it. And I will make another video explaining how acorn works and how I use it to make to save a little bit more money and to keep track of it. It's not the best way, but it works for me, so I'm happy with them. So going back to what I'm saying, if when I get my money taken out from my Wells Fargo account and sent to Acorns, I know what to spend and I know what not to spend. So regarding my Wells Fargo account, I will spend on that card necessary stuff, meaning bills. My phone bill, it was gonna, it's automatically already set up from my Wells Fargo account. So whenever I have to pay my my uh, my phone bill, it will be taken out from my Wells Fargo card, my Wells Fargo card, okay? And not from my Acorns. My Acorn is for the expenses I need. So it's a good way where I track my money and it's easy for me. It's easy for me to know where my money is going by tracking it, okay? It's essential for me to know where is it at. So I'm not keeping the same bank account and the rest that is left when I already pay my, my when I already pay my bill, what's left for it is saving it. Once I know what's that I paid all my bills regarding phone bill, rent, uh, water bills, and all that. Let's say I'm I'm left with uh, four hundred dollars, three hundred dollars. I will use that money and put it in my savings account. From there, I will move it to my investing account. That's what I do, and it works for me. I move my money. I don't keep it in one place. You should try it to so you can see where to cut back, right? You want to cut back and you need to know where to cut back. So that's why you distribute your money to keep track of it. That's how I do it. I have two different debit cards, one source of income. From there, it comes to my first debit card. That's my Wells Fargo card to my Acorns account. I spent my Acorns card and necessary stuff. And I like that card because it gives you uh, in certain places like Walmart, Chevron, it will give you a little uh, percentage back invested to your Acorns account. So it's great for me. It works for me. I love Acorns. I have an, an investment portfolio with them. And I will be showing you that too if you are interested. So for now, just know that it's important for you to keep track of your money and know where it's going so you can save your money and so you can invest. And I thank you guys for watching this video. Subscribe, like this video and expect more guys yes it's gonna be a great journey right now
If you're interested in financial freedom, reaching financial freedom, any type, investing, if you're interested in investing, reaching financial freedom, and all that good stuff, entrepreneurship, starting an online business, all that stuff, I will be covering it in my channel, okay? See you in the next video. If, it's, if this video was helpful, make sure to like it, subscribe, and more is going to come out. I appreciate your guys' time if you make it to the end of the video. If I provide enough value, I'm thankful I am. That's what I'm trying to do. And just guys know, I'm trying my best here. So peace out. Bye-bye.